we're seeing record numbers of initial unemployment compensation claims come through our system. We just announced today that our official total for last week was 80,984 claims were, were uh, taken, either online or by telephone. Um, obviously, these are record-setting numbers. Um, we continue to see more and more claims being filed every day. Normally, the self-employed and, and uh, church employees, nonprofit employees, um, people like that, they would normally be excluded for, uh, for um, unemployment compensation benefits. Um, however, under the CARES Act, which was passed by Congress in, last week and signed by the president, mm -hmm. they are included under a program called Pandemic Unemployment Assistance. Um, we have not yet received official guidance from USDOL on how and when to implement that program. However, we are telling those, those workers who believe they may be affected to go ahead and file a claim. Um, again, like I said before, once we do get those get the official instructions, we will be able to make those those claims retroactive to pay to pay the uh, the claimant from the time they actually left work. Um, but this way, they will be, they'll be able to go ahead and get their information in the system. And, and, and that, you know, and I understand that it will help people to feel like they're, they're being proactive and, right. and taking some action on their behalf. So, yes, go ahead and file. And as soon as we get those official instructions and we have more information to provide with those people, um, we're going to get that out as quickly as we can. Sure. We're, we're hoping to get that information soon. They should visit our website at labor.alabama.gov and go ahead and file an unemployment claim. Um, it's also available by phone, but I would encourage anyone who can to do this online. Um, obviously, there are only so many people who can answer the phones, and our phones are basically backed up from the moment they open. Um, we, we understand this is frustrating. We understand this is a problem. We're working as quickly as we can uh, to, to remedy that situation. We're working on training uh, and repurposing other staff to, to help with the phone lines uh, and perhaps hiring new staff. Um, but the online system is, is going to probably be your, your fastest way. There are also slowdowns with it. Um, we hear those concerns and those complaints as well, and we completely understand. We understand it's frustrating. Additionally, we've been working day and night for the past two weeks to make improvements to that site. And we know that the improvements are working because we're seeing more and more claims being filed successfully with each passing day. However, I understand that that doesn't help those people who are still not able to get through. Um, so I would encourage those people to just please be patient and to keep trying. Um, the, if you just keep trying, eventually you will get through. And, and don't worry. Even, even if you're not able to get through right away, we are able to make those claims retroactive. So you will still be paid from the time that you were actually let go. So, 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 so don't worry that you're not getting your claim in the day you got let go. Um, we, we, can, we can handle that.